Hi, it's Claire again. It's probably about day 18, maybe. I don't know. I haven't checked. Just been for a 4K run. Feeling good. Better than I did before I went, which is always good. So I just wanted to jump on and talk about something that struck me today. The analogy of three feet from gold. Okay, so... When you start on a new journey, it could be a journey of fitness, it could be um, like, it could be to do with what you're eating, healthy eating regime, it could be starting a new business, it could be anything that you're starting on a new journey. It's very easy to quit, really easy to quit. And you normally want to quit round about a sort of turning point of momentum, literally three feet from gold. So this morning I woke up and I was feeling a bit like that. I was feeling a bit like, oh, is this the right move for me to do? Should I be doing an online course? Uh, is anybody interested in what I've got to say, what I've got to post? Talk, talk questions like that going through my mind. Also feeling like, okay, I'm started on a new health and fitness regime. Scales haven't budged, not a tiny bit. So obviously that's quite deflating. And I've set myself some goals, goals for business, goals for my health and wellness. And part of my goal is to run twice a week, do two yoga sessions a week and two um, strength and conditioning workouts. So that's the goal I've set myself. It's, it's um, quite specific. It's quite achievable. Uh, so they're the goals I've set myself. And obviously last week managed that pretty well. Uh, how the results coming in yet? No, can be deflating. And yesterday, what did I do yesterday? I did some yoga, did some strength and conditioning work. And then I realised it's Wednesday. I haven't been out for a run yet. And this morning I woke up and thought, oh God, I really can't be bothered to go for a run. Should I just do some yoga instead? Because obviously yoga is more, more gentle. We need to listen to our bodies, what we need in the moment and the time. So I thought, well, okay, I'm not going to beat myself up about not going for a run. I'm going to do some nice gentle yoga stretches and then I was getting ready for, I teach yoga today, I teach kids yoga, special needs class, absolutely love it and I was getting ready for my class and part of today's story for the little ones is um, about a magician. So it's a magician. So I needed a magician's wand. And I was like, oh crap, I've broken my, ma one of the kids broke my magician's wand last time I used it. So I went upstairs and thought, oh, I need to fix this. So I had to thread a little bit of ribbon through a tiny, tiny, tiny hole like this. And I was finding, try looking around the house, looking for anything to thread this bit of ribbon through this hole. And I was so close, so, so close to it. I could see it at the end. I was so, so close. And it was so easy to just go, oh, sorry, I can't bother. I won't use the wand. But I was determined to get this thread through this hole for this magician's wand from my class today. And I did it. I did it. And it made me realise that actually, do you know what? When we're so close to quitting is the time when we need to carry on. We need to keep going. We need, we're so, so close to building momentum and getting results. So that's my little words of wisdom to you today. I got my butt out for a run, by the way, based on me getting the little thread through the wand. It made me realise that, do you know what? I might not be seeing the results on the scales at the moment, but I'm so close to getting fitter, healthier, stronger, and I'm going to keep going. And I want you to keep going today, whatever it is you're doing. And it's the same analogy for my business. I know that I keep putting material out here. I keep connecting with people. The right people will come and the right people will connect with me. So that's my message to you today. So if you are one of those people and do want to connect with me and you're interested in joining my pilot course, Mindfulness for Manifestation, then do get in contact, drop me a message below and subscribe to my channel for more insightful analogies. Bye.